Almo bleed into another video of a very characteristic localizing sign. Let us see. Right gaze palsy to the left. The left eye only can move with a dysmetric movements, nystagmus-like movements. Convergence is normal. Up gaze is normal. Low gaze is also normal. Now, here is the thing. On asking this lady to look to the right, there is no right movement of both eyes. She has a right gaze palsy. On asking her to look to the left, the, uh, the left eye only can abduct with dysmetric movements, nystagmus-like movements. Then this lady has loss of movements of one eye and loss of movements of half of the other eye. This is called one and a half syndrome. This is an easy disorder. All of you will know it. Ask the patient to look on the moving target in the z-axis. He can't converge. He has a convergence paralysis, which denotes lesions of the midbrain, cerebral lesion, Parkinson's disease, and also in progressive supranuclear palsy. And don't forget, there are some peripheral diseases that lead to Convergence insufficiency or almost convergence paralysis like thyroid eye disease or any other causes of restrictive orbitopathy.